Here in BC, there are many different plans to further exploit the fossil fuel industry with new pipelines and LNG plants. If successful, tanker traffic along the BC coastline will increase exponentially, bringing with it the risk of oil spills. The effect of a spill to the coastline would be devastating. Tofino would never be the same if a spill happened. Beyond the obvious effect to marine and animal life are the not so obvious effects to the people of the region, particularly the Tolokiat Nation. Gone would be the days the ocean could be harvested for food. Gone would be the tourist industry that depends on a pristine environment. Gone would be the recreation that so many currently enjoy in Tofino. And Tofino is just one of many communities that would potentially be affected. There are many, including myself, working to protect the pristine nature of BC. Without it, we would not be known as beautiful British Columbia. I think that in Tofino, we are fairly isolated in a way that uh, we live in such a pristine place and we are so removed from the really blatant industrialization of the land. Sometimes if we stay here too long or we don't ever turn the news on, you can kind of forget that there is all sorts of destruction going on. But I think right now that one of the things that is pretty in our faces is the threat or the knowing that these tankers start cruising up and down our coasts. This way that we live and the things we enjoy and the way that we make our money so that we can survive, that is something that is really real for me and really real for a lot of people here on the coast. We are impacted by what large corporations, large business does. The, the transporting of crude oil along the coastline, spillage from the pipelines, anything that is going to impact the shoreline and, and anything out here. So many people look at the ocean and think that if you do something in one area, it doesn't affect anywhere else. But it's water, it's all connected and anything that gets put into it is part of that system and it, and it affects everything else. In my 60 plus years on the planet, I have contributed to and witnessed environmental degradation like never seen before. Many years ago, I made a commitment to send a healthy and vibrant planet into the future. What if my great-great-grandchildren never get to experience this place the way I did because we didn't take care of it? What if all that's left for my great-great-grandchildren is an ocean full of plastic? What if the air is so toxic that my great-great-grandchildren cannot take a breath of fresh air? What if? It's up to me to hand off a healthy and vibrant planet. This planet does not belong to me. It belongs to future generations. I will do whatever it takes to make sure my great-great-grandchildren can experience what I know to be possible.